I guess in general, I have just really loved like 100% of my experience with the environmental engineering department in particular. The faculty all are like really personally invested in like our success, which is really nice. Um, and all of them are doing really interesting research and um, have different involvements that they will willingly tell you about in case, uh, like if you think you're interested in it as well which is really cool. Um, I also love all of the labs and the classes I have had. They're all really hands-on and you get right from the get-go very like real world applications. So, but also the, my peers within my program are like phenomenal. It's really cool to be surrounded with like-minded people, uh, which I'm sure is true is in any major, but everyone I've met has just been like really great. I've met some of my best friends in the last year up here. So the Pavlis Honors College really uh, gave me a space to, um, starting right from my first seminar, to like define my goals and how to get there. And it really gave me an environment, both with um, the faculty who are in the college as well as my peers, to just um, really like encourage me to continue to chase those goals and um, find different ways and different outlets that I could reach them and make connections with different people across campus um, and even like in industry. In general, uh, I think that this is just a really great place if you want to go somewhere and you want to like know your professors, know even like your deans. And it's just really nice um, to have your professors be like really involved in your studies, at least for me personally. And I think that's a really great opportunity for tech, I think our curriculum in general is very hands-on, but I know for environmental engineering, it's really, really hands-on. So if that's the kind of thing that uh, someone might be looking for, uh, it's a really great opportunity for that. I know the last two weeks, I have a lab that I've spent snowshoeing around taking like snow and ice samples. Um, so it's really cool. It's not just like sitting in a room and getting talked at for a couple hours. It's a lot of like going out and actually doing things in field. But also in general, like for tech as well, uh, it is sometimes very daunting as a female student to know that you're coming up here where uh, we only make up about a quarter of the student body. But there's a lot of different organizations you can get involved in on campus. Um, Society for Women and Engineers, we have a Women's Leadership Council, and there's definitely ways to kind of bridge that feeling.